SmackDown recap. Yeah. The SmackDown after WrestleMania. And the Tuesday before, uh, like, ten minutes before midnight <laughs> that you decide to make this. I always do. Well, yeah. let's see. You have to watch The Miz, and then you have to watch 205. So. Let's see. New Day starts off SmackDown. But having, like, um, a celebration with Co the balloons and pancakes. Yeah. Kofi uh, points out that his wife, Chi-Chi, and his two sons are sitting out right there in front. Yep. Which is kind of funny. <laughs> Chi-Chi. Yeah, every time you say Chi-Chi, you think of Dragon Ball. Yeah. They're saying that uh, the family like, deserve it. And that. He, he would have been a dual champion. If it wasn't for the bar. Like Becky Lynch. And, um... So the New Day calls out Cesaro and Sheamus. And then they were, like, saying... No, they didn't call him out. They interrupted them. You sure? Yeah. Um, and then the bar came out. Because Kofi... The bar came out after Kofi was thanking his family for being a role modeler. A role model, a father, and a husband, and the bar came out saying that they, the reason why they stopped the they interfered in the match is because they fi figured that Kofi's going to lose and then SmackDown would lose the titles. So they issued a challenge to the New Day. Uh, it was a six man tag team match. Yeah, and Biggie at first was like. Wait, am I a little off? Is There's three of us and only two of you. But the bar ends up calling out Drew McIntyre. Of course Tartar yeah. Sauce and Baldy did. Of course they did. <laughs> but that's later tonight, that match. Um, the actually first match of that night was a six-man tag as well. Was mm -hmm. Austin Black, Ricochet, and Mustafa Ali. Yeah. Versus Rusev and Come, Come on. on. And Sienna Olmez. Yeah. Which is funny because the, so, the main editor of Cien Omas is. So that's what? Pretty much good guys versus bad guys, huh? Like always. Oh, Mustafa yeah. Ali won it. But yeah. after the match, after Mustafa Ali's like being all happy that he won, uh, Randy Orton shows up, gives him an RKO. Yep. And then, um. What was it? Kevin Owens did a stunner to Rusev. Yeah. That was pretty. So, yeah. That was that. Well, they're just doing... They're sending everybody out because the shake-up's next week. Yeah, I think it's, they're doing, doing that, but yeah, so they can say who wants to get the first one, the first pick. Because that's the main thing. You want to be the first pick. I showed your mm -hmm. number one superstar. Yeah. Well, our truth is... Uh, our truth and Carmella are celebrating after, you know, the WrestleMania thing. Yeah. Because Carmella's now the... um. The, 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 she won the women's battle royale. Yeah, so she's pretty much just taking our truth for whatever. Hmm. And, and then, then Samoa Joe comes out. Flubba Bubba. He's mad. He he uh, puts truth to sleep, and he's like saying that he's the he beat Rey Mysterio in under a minute, so he's the most dangerous champion. Yeah. So and then um. He, well, he, then Braun Strowman comes out. Get these hands. Yeah, and then we see Samoa Joe try to choke out Strowman, and you're getting upset, like, no, don't come out like a pussy, and then Strowman actually... That would be stupid, actually, though. And then Strowman reverses his move, and then Joe yeah. just walk, uh, yeah, runs he's away. Yeah, like, tries to lift him up. It's, <laughs> it's, it's a lot, you know? So, flub a bubble. And then, um... The Iconics. Yeah. They got the best that Brooklyn, ta uh, the tag team has to offer, which is basically two jobber girls. Yeah. But someone's watching in the back, and it is Paige. And she said she was watching, and she looks unimpressed. So next week, she's going to bring out her own tag teams. To challenge the Iconics. Yeah, her best tag team. But, yeah, Iconics beat the Brooklyn Bells, whatever they are. 
because I'm going to want to do the first half of the fence. Yeah, then we see Shane McMahon just uh, saying how he's happy, how he beat up The Miz, and he smacked around uh, Mr. Miz, or Big Potato Face. <laughs> and then he started bullying um, the guy that does the ring announcements. Yeah, he's freaking Forcing little... him to say the best in the world. Yeah, he's, uh, he's literally dragged him by his tie all the way up to the... Making him say it all over and over and, and over. over. Until he get it right, and then when he at the top of the stage, then he actually says it right. Yeah. Because he's like, don't worry about these fans. You just have to worry about me. No one's going to uh -huh. threaten to do anything to you. Blah, blah, blah. Well, let's see. After that... The Hardy Boys versus the Usos for the tag team titles. And lo and behold, mm. the Hardy Boys actually win. Yep, new SmackDown tag champs. Yeah. A twist of fate and then a uh, Swanton bomb for the win. And then out comes... Lars Sullivan attacks yeah. both the Hardy Boys. Yep, they try, but Lars didn't sell to all like always, so... So. Then we got Becky Lynch. Yes, then Becky Lynch is pretty mm -hmm. much saying if you meet, if you, um, you will meet the redhead devil if you think you could take the titles from her. Then Lacey Evans showed up, right? Or was it that just, um, or was that just a, a flashback? No, she, she literally, uh, because she was like, she clawed away, so. This way you ain't gonna go. But then she's walking up to the ramp, brings her title, and then Aunt Lacey Evans comes and taps her from behind. Mm-hmm. And while she's hurt on the ground, Lacey Evans just walks away. Walks away. Oh, well, that'd be so, a good match to see. It's probably gonna end up being a Lacey Evans versus Becky Lynch. Gonna be one heck of a cat fight. Then our main event. The New Day. New Day? Versus the Bar and McIntyre. Yeah, and before that match started, Sami Zayn came out. Loser. And the crowd is pretty much sing like humming along to his song, and he's listening, and then all of a sudden he goes, you're not worth it, and then leaves. And then the match started. Yeah. Kofi does his trouble in paradise, and he actually wins the match. Yep, he wins it for them. He does it to Sheamus. He, Kofi actually got rid of Cesaro to make sure Cesaro don't interfere at all. And after winning, he takes his boys and his wife into the ring and they celebrate. Oh, yeah. It was really good. It was a good SmackDown. It was like a really good SmackDown, I say so. Nothing really wowing or anything. Yeah, it's not no wowy. Special, but no special it was good. thing like what happened last night. No. But it was. Okay. Especially the Saturday on Raw. Mm. Dean. But. Yeah, Dean thanking all the fans, saying he, his memorable things, and they do the final shield fist bump. Yep. Yeah. Mm. So. Because that, that's a better way for Dean to go out. Instead of him going out like a bitch with just being planted through a table by, um. But, the, but it's so fucked up that. It's an exclusive that you have to watch on YouTube or whatever. You don't see it on TV, but you can tell, oh, because they have uh, TV shows and whatever to be on at the same time. Yeah. But then again, you could still do it. You just you got to shorten the commercials on those shows. Yeah. So you'll be able to watch the whole show with no commercials. Yeah. So, so, what did you thought this week of SmackDown? Are you excited for next week when they shake it all up? Yeah, I wonder who's going to be all on Raw and what's all going to be on SmackDown. I wonder where well, like, Nikki play, can play. I oh. wonder where she's going to end up. Well, we got NXT tomorrow, so we got to find out. Are yeah, they going to take any new superstars mm -hmm. from there? Yeah, sometimes they take some NXT superstars, too. Yeah. So, we'll have to wait and see. It's going to be interesting, so, yeah. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Hey, and we're back hey. with 205. Oh, yeah, yeah.
And it's the 205 Live at the WrestleMania. After seeing Tony Nese win the Cruiserweight Championship. Mm-hmm. Ab checker. Yep. That was awesome. Happy he won. No more Toothpick's boyfriend. Yep. Which they're going to have a WrestleMania rematch later tonight of it. Mm-hmm. Um, now, let's see what else. And the first match of the night was Jack Gallagher with Drew Gulak coming out. Yuck. And so we're going to get Humberto Carrillo, which, I'm sorry, it looks like kind of locked yeah. there. Okay. Put Humberto Carrillo side by side with Taylor Lochner, and you tell me they don't look the same. They don't look the same. But end up be oh, okay, it was going okay, it was going okay. Um, end up being a DQ because of Drew Gulak. Humberto was going on the top rope to get ready to do a top rope move. Drew Gulak pushed him off. So right from his butt. And, of course, and then he's in the ring, he's attacking Humberto, he's like, um... Pretty much like, listen to me. Yeah, listen to me, he goes to me, listen! And then, he was about to punch, and then Jack Gowler, a big shocker, grabs his hand, makes Drew Gulak look at him, and then he headbutts him, and Drew get rolled out of the ring. Leaving Humberto shocked, like... Yeah, he was a little shocked. His eyes were a little popping out So, there. oh boy, is uh, Jack Gallagher turning face? Mm. But I don't care, even if he does turn face, I still don't like him. <laughs> yeah, I never... I, I like Humberto. He, he's not a bad wrestler. He, especially with his flips. Yeah. Seems interesting. And then, there was a um, little thing of Tony sitting, he was talking... Saying that how he won his dream, and tonight is gonna be one more time, and he's gonna be, it's gonna be unstoppable. You're pretty much, he's gonna win again. He's pretty much saying that he's gonna win. Really. And then there was an interview backstage with Oni and Drake Maverick, and then Cedric came along. I guess we were talking, Bug and then eyes. Sandra came out, and then Drake's like, oh, I'm, I'm talking to Oni at the moment. I was like, I know, I know. And then they're pretty much going to be having a match next week on, on Twelve Five Live. But Oni saying something about, yeah, I'm back, and I see you're still here, and whatnot, so. Wonder how that match is going to be. I don't know, we're going to have to let, see how it pans out. Oni and Cedric. I hope Cedric wins. Oh, yeah. Especially boogly eyes there. Yeah, every time either he doesn't win right away, he goes, Boing. Boing. And now the main event. Yeah. Buddy Murphy. Toothpick's boyfriend. First, Tony Nese. Ab checker. For the Cruiserweight title, WrestleMania rematch. Now, this mm -hmm. match was crazy. It's getting there. Um, Buddy oh. Murphy at first, um... He was getting it, he was, his knee was hurting partial of the match, but he was okay, he said he was okay to try to wrestle, but, he, uh, faked it, and then hit Vicky Tony's in behind, try, because, what do you, what do you know? But, um, a couple later of the match, he hit a Murphy Law, that he pinned him, well, actually, he did the knee thing, and then the Murphy Law, yep. and pinned, and uh Tony's kicked out and then Murphy's like all shy like what like what the how did I lose <sighs> and then he did another knee thing and he was trying to go for the Murphy law again which didn't work nope because Tony knees countered him mm -hmm. and then he hit him with the knee and then making him like fall into the corner and then he runs towards the corner and does a running knee into yep. the corner for the win. So he what he did pretty much at WrestleMania is how he won tonight. So pretty yep. much you're just seeing what you missed at WrestleMania. <laughs> but that was an interesting man. I'm still happy that Tony needs to still jam. Yep. So I was able to still have like two it was, matches. It was, yeah, it was pretty good. And even though it was like you said, two matches. Wish it could have been more, but no uh 
That's what I said. Yeah, so... No uh, shocker, no really surprise. I mean... The only little shock was Jack Hiller headbutting that, Drew, yeah. but, but that was really that nothing. Was, no, that, that was just... That was pretty much the only new... Th really. Yeah. Th turn, like, and turn a new leaf. Maybe that's what he's doing. So, so now what, what is it going to be, like, a superhero group now? <laughs> <laughs> so what did you thought of this figure? 205 Live! Yeah. You shocked for Jack Allen? Are you happy Tony's still champ? Are you excited for next week? Oliver Cedric? Who do you want mm -hmm. to win? Let us know. Or like to hear. they uh, put any new wrestlers in, they might. I mean, this is 205. Ember! I mean. Superstar Shake-Up. Yeah, they could be switching things around. So, yeah, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Okay. I'll see you next time. Yeah, bye. bye.